Yo yo yo, what's up? It's Ruby here, and today I will be showing to you my manga haul for the month of May. I have like 60, around 60 new manga volumes, and that is because I earned like the highest possible incentive bonus last April, and I got the bonus this um, month. So um yeah, <laughs> um, as a typical Filipino, I say I deserve this. Manga haul. <laughs> so um, let's start with this manga, Kaiju Number no. Eight, uh, Volume Two. Um, this is the in between of My Hero Academia and Attack on Titan, and I love those two manga. That's why I also fell in love with this series. The artwork is really nice. The story is okay. <laughs> Hoping that it will get better, but um, I'm enjoying it so far. The um comedy. And the action kaiju number eight <laughs> the next one is alice in borderland i enjoyed the netflix series that's why i'm intrigued and i'm excited to read the manga um, my only issue with this one is it's only 300 pages long short <laughs> it's too short for me like i read the entire volume for 20 minutes the next one is the third volume of uh, Seven Deadly Sins. This is an omnibus copy. I really like the connecting spine. Um, actually, I prefer omnibus manga and uh, I prefer this size. I don't know. <laughs> um, actually, I plan on dropping um, Seven Deadly Sins because um, I already watched the anime. I enjoyed it. But um, after flipping the first volume, like, I fell in love with the art style. That's why I'm planning to continue collecting the entire series. The next one is, this is a raw manga. It's Bitum. I have here volume 1, 11, 16, 24, 25. And I'm planning on collecting all of the uh, Japanese manga. Uh, the reason why I'm collecting the Japanese manga is because the English translation is very expensive and I don't think I can afford it and um, Bitum is my third favorite manga of all time um, and um, also this is like a project of mine like my cousin and I and I'm um, also my best friend is translating these raw mangas like for the uh, I'm not sure if you can notice the text here like this is the translation we're using metallic um, pen, gel pen for the black pages and then friction pen on the white pages so we can erase it if we um, made a mistake. Um, actually, we also tried um, using the transparent memo pad but uh, it's smudge and then um, um, by just you know, you know rubbing you can erase the text so um, I do not recommend using the transparent memo pad. The next one is Shaman King Omnibus texture omnibus 9 or 8 i'm very excited because um few more mangas to complete this series i really i mean the story of shaman king is okay the um the fight scene is okay but i just like to see them evolve their character development that's why i'm enjoying shaman king so much and i'm also for the art style i really enjoy the art this manga is like i have no choice but to get this <laughs> because of some like incident um it's it's an adult manga <laughs> um my bride is the demon lord question mark <laughs> um yeah I, to be honest i enjoyed the art style but i haven't finished and um there is a story surprisingly there is a story <laughs> but i'm ha but i haven't read in but i haven't read the entire um book yet because um it's hard to read something like this when you're living with your parents <laughs> you know the next one is um the legend the legendary hero is dead um i have your volume three four five six seven eight um, and I heard that there will be an anime adaptation for this in 2023. I already ordered volume 1 and 2, waiting for them to arrive, hopefully soon. Um, I heard mixed reviews about this manga. Like, they, they say that this is a hidden 
uh, gem and um, some says that it just contains a lot of fan service and that put off a lot of like reader for this series but um for me we'll see <laughs> And next one is I have here Mobile Gundam Suit, a uh, Mobile Suit Gundam Thunderbolt. I got these two manga for 99 pesos only, and you know I like that there are colored pages, just like the um, uh, Mobile Gundam Suit the Origin. Like there's so many colored pages. I hope like I hope a lot of manga also have like colored pages, especially those without anime adaptation in order for me to like visualize them in color if you know what I mean <laughs> um the next one is I have here um the adventures seem bad I have here volume one two three and four um and I just noticed earlier that um this is not uh this is a story of um Shinobu Otakadi um creator of Maggie but uh, the artist is Yo Yoshifumi Otera However, the art doesn't seem to be that different with the Maggie series. So um, I'm very happy with this one. Um, the next one is, uh, this is a one-shot manga. It's Laughter at the World's End. Uh, this is from the creator of Kekaishi, I think. Um, I'm halfway through the manga and um, I'm not that thrilled. <laughs> Hopefully, it get better at the end. Yep. And um, third to the last is I have random volumes from Fairy Tale 44, 45, 46, 52, and uh, 42. Um, a few more manga to complete my Fairy Tale um, series. Uh, some call this series trash. And um, if you own a manga and you call it trash, I mean, I'm willing to um, collect your garbage. <laughs> Um, okay, so um, second to the last is I have the entire, ah, uh, sorry, I have volume 1 up to 27 of Naruto. <laughs> I'm so happy that I got this manga for 6,000 pesos. Um, and um, as you can notice in the background, I now have, I, I now own the top 3 manga of all time and it's One Piece and Bleach. I'm on track with One Piece and I have the complete Bleach series. So I'm um, just gonna get the box set 2 and 3 for the Naruto. Yay! <laughs> Before I show you the last um, series that I got this month, I have to like stretch because this is so damn heavy. <laughs> um, it's the Mobile Gundam Suit. Oh sorry, Mobile Suit Gundam The Origin. Um, oh, I'm so happy with this one because I've been meaning to have this and I got this for a very cheap price. I can't believe it. <laughs> I'm only missing volume 10 and 12 and um, it's out of stock in our local bookstore. So um, like, I don't know where can I get those two volumes but um, hopefully I can find them soon. <laughs> so um, I guess this is all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, bye-bye. <laughs>